Good morning. It is Monday, May, uh, March 6th. Wow. Um, and it's actually early afternoon. Uh, I've kind of had a weird morning. I woke up at like 5 a.m. this morning and then just could not go back to sleep um, for like three hours. But uh, I, I started my dishwasher. I got that all loaded up. I'm going to start laundry this afternoon. And um, so my date night, yay, it was so much fun. Uh, we went out to dinner and had, uh, we went to one of my husband's favorite restaurants, Texas Roadhouse. We have lots of fun there and of course we come back with so many leftovers. It takes us a week to get through leftovers so I really don't have to cook a lot. Which is sad because I really like to cook. Um, my marinade and my uh, beef jerky. I will be dehydrating that later today. I'll put it in tonight. I will record it for you guys. And um, this week I am going to be making one of my husband's favorites, uh, an American classic called meatloaf. I make it a little bit different out here on the East Coast. A lot of people do what's called a double sauced meatloaf. I find them very dry. I don't like them. Um, I was taught to do meatloaf a totally different way and so I'll be showing you guys that later. So um, we did pick up a scale this weekend and I don't know the difference between my scale and the doctor's scale, how far off, but um, if they're not, if they're the same, which logically they're supposed to be, but you know that never works. Um, apparently I've lost a little over three pounds, which is so nice. So yay, I'm happy. Um, tomorrow, Tuesday is my doctor's appointment with the new doctor again. So, um, We'll be commenting on uh, we'll be working up on that but so far today I've had my cup of coffee I ate a little bit of the steak leftovers from Texas Roadhouse and steak is really hard for me to process so um, I have to like chew it like one bite I chew probably close to a hundred hundred and fifty times because it's really hard for me to digest it um, that's another thing about weight loss. You can use it, uh, chewing your food. The process of mastication, which is choo choo. <laughs> That's prim. Um, the process of mastication takes a lot, it uh, takes a few calories, okay? So, I mean, weight loss is supposed to be simple math. X amount of calories go in, you have to exert X amount of uh, exercise to burn said calories to have. Uh, to weigh and balance things. For simple math, it really is complicated. But I exert probably, I, I don't, I can't exercise. I mean, I can do my yoga, I can do partial yoga, and um, I meditate, uh, my meditation, which really helps. But as of going out and doing five miles, that's never gonna happen, not with my knees. Um, I do have a stationary bike that I do do. It's called a recumbent bike. It's not, you're not sitting straight, you're, you're actually at an angle. Um, I do do that and I do five or six miles on that, um, which takes me about 15 minutes. It's not that, it's not that long, but I mean, it, I can't go long on it because my knees hurt and um, well, pain is pain and pain is not good. Uh, so I, I, I take it easy. I, I'm not gonna, I, I'm not trying to destroy my knees any worse than they are because <laughs> the doctors are not going to give me a knee transplant anytime soon. Um, when I was in my thirties, they said, oh, we'll talk about it when we hit 40. Well, I've hit 40, I've passed 40. And now they're saying the first chance we'll do it is in your fifties. <clears throat> so I get to be a stay at home that has very limited mobility because of the fact that I'm so young and the fact that we have very old people in our ha in our family. I mean, natural cause deaths are in the 90s and we've actually had a couple of octogenarians. Um, so yeah, I'm expected to live a long life and I'm not looking forward to it in the state that I'm in. But I am trying to get in a better state. So today we're doing dishes, some laundry. That's about it. Uh, for dinner tonight, I'm 
thinking I'm gonna go with a tuna noodle casserole. I mean, it's in the 40s right now, so it actually warmed up. It was in the teens this weekend. It was freezing, it was so cold. I'm so happy I didn't start my seats. But we're supposed to be in the, the cat's playing with the phone. Uh, we're supposed to be in the 40s and 50s for this week, so I might look into it. I wanna make sure what next week's kind of looking like. Um, although my husband did say something about snow. I like the snow, I do, but I wanna plant my seeds. So, um, that's it. Uh, let's see, is there anything else? Mm, no. Oh, I did do a video on the cookies that I made. I made the macadamia, uh, white chocolate chip macadamia nut cookies. Uh, I will piece that together. I'm getting better. I'm getting better at editing. I want to say thank you to Brad at Big Family Homestead for doing that tech talk. It helps so much. Um, but yeah, no, we're that's what we're doing. Uh, today is just kind of a boring day around here. Nothing really big happening. My husband and I wanted to get to that that is a storage area above our washer and dryer and it is a mess but when it was 20 degrees outside it was like 45 in our house and we just wanted to get the house warmed up enough that we weren't all gonna have the flu again so yeah that's all that's happening today nothing really big um Oh, I was going to do a book review on um, a series of books. It's actually an entire author that I've read. I haven't read anything by her that I don't like yet. And she's just really cool. I, I love her series. I love her message in her books. Um, it's a very earth-friendly, homestead kind of message. You know, get back to your roots kind of thing. Um, so I'm going to do a... Uh, an author review. I think I'm gonna do an author review, not just a book review, because she's got several books. I mean, she's got like six series of books, and I've read every one of them, and they're they're pretty quick reads, but they they have a significant message in them, which I think we need to reach to our youths. So, I hope you all have a good day. I'll check in with you tomorrow before I go to my doctor's appointment. Ah, ah. You guys all have a great day, and uh, thanks for watching uh, uh, Jen's Home with At Home with Jen. Bye-bye. Oh, please like and subscribe, and um, see you later.